This next exercise is the roller pec stretch. What we're going to need is a foam roller, one of the long three foot rollers. You want to lay supine on the roller and what's really important is that we get our lumbar spine completely flat. We want to maintain this position throughout the drill. This is going to keep us from cheating and trying to substitute lumbar extension in for shoulder mobility. So we, what we want to do is cue the client to slightly posterior tilt their, their pelvis so that way they can get flat on the, the uh, roller. Then we want to rotate our palms up and we want to get the client to create a fist and squeeze it tight. This is going to encourage some radiation from the grip all the way up in the shoulder to help develop some neurological drive into the rotator cuff and all the other stabilizing muscles around the scapulothoracic joint. Then we want to cue the client to take a big breath in the nose and then take a long exhale where they draw the ribs down and slowly slide those arms up trying to press them into the floor. They're just going to go as far as they can without the arms picking up off the ground and they're going to inhale, come down, maintain uh, contact with the roller, then exhale, slide up, draw these ribs down and think about pressing those arms down into the floor. Okay, just go as far as you can without the hands coming up. You don't have to go as far up as Ariel is here. Even if you just get to right about here, that's fine. Just go to where you can. In each rep, we want to slowly try to progress to go a little bit higher up.